Well, you've heard the saying, when the going gets tough, the tough get going. Well, a girl from Granite Bay really added new meaning to that phrase after competing in the National Junior Olympic Cross Country Championship in Reno. It wasn't the foot of snow on the ground, but rather what happened to her foot along the course. News 10's Alicia Malaby explains. At age 13, runner Claire Carroll has chalked up some impressive victories. I'm free, basically. I just can go do whatever I want to do and just run. When Claire competed in her first national cross-country championship last weekend, she had a goal in mind. I had a goal to get you know, top three, top five in the race. Heavy snowfall in Reno made conditions challenging. This video shows more than 200 girls starting up a long hill. A half mile into the race, Claire faced an even bigger challenge. One of the girls stepped on the back of my shoe and just pulled it off. I sort of stumbled, but then I kept going. Claire made the choice to keep running in her sock in the snow. My foot got really numb and I stopped really feeling it. The only time I could really feel my foot was when I'd ran run through the mud. <laughs> Claire's dad, Paul, was stunned to see her running without a shoe. I didn't really know what to think. I mean, you're, you're lopsided when you're running, you have no traction. I just, I, I didn't know whether she was gonna be able to sustain it. Claire not only ran two miles in her sock, she finished third in the nation and carried her shoe in her left hand with an electronic timing device across the finish line. There's actually this quote from Steve Prefontaine saying, I don't watch a race to see who wins. I watch the races who have the most guts. And I had a lot of people telling me, wow, that takes guts to do that. With her shoe to remember her race, Claire learned something about herself, a life lesson for all of us. Even if something goes wrong, you can still push through it and still go towards your goal and do what you can to get there. In Sacramento County, Alicia Malaby, News 10. That is just amazing. Uh, Claire, who is also a downhill skier, says it took about an hour for her foot to thaw out. By the way, she finished the race in 15 minutes, 28 seconds. Uh, that's a story I would expect to go national on News10.net. Unbelievable.